Welcome back to Elevator Land 2. Nice. <laughs> Prime. <laughs> two Prime. <laughs> Elevator 2 Prime. Anyway. Uh, Elevator so Prime 2. They clone Ridley, and right, that's the right. one you kill in Fusion. So, like, just to recap what we said in the last episode. Um, so Ridley's died a lot of times. Yeah. And, like, the first game or something, yeah. you kill him, and then shit explodes. And then they clone him at that base or something. And then the X yeah. infect the clone that's like on ice. And then you have to fight. On ice. Then you have to fight the clone. <laughs> X parasite. Oh, and then. Fuck. Oh, fuck. Shit. fuck. And then the space pirates oh, are like. Oh, damn, it. Oh, damn, damn it! Damn it! Damn it! I was out of the. I was out of the flames. Lava's what's gonna kill you, dude. It's lava. It's not lava. No! <laughs> it it won't like be lava. lava. It looks like lava. Are you shitting me? I can't. It's All right. your destiny. <laughs> lava is making you a bitch right now. <laughs> so fuck, dude. Uh, you made it barely. No! Get me out of here! <laughs> Anywhere that's not. Oh my god, there's fun. more bullets flying in as I went in. <laughs> oh my gosh, okay. that was intense. Alright, I need to go to. Anyway, so the space pirates remake Ridley, and now he's here. Okay. And this is the Ridley we're dealing with right now. I, I think this is the last time we fight Ridley, is it? Has really showed up in any storyline. I didn't get to play. I didn't get to play the second Prime, so I don't know if he shows up there. I, I only played I, the beginning from of what the I third played one. of the second one. I didn't see him. And the third one, I think it was a lot about like cooler in the world. Yeah, the third one did a lot of cool stuff. Yeah, the whole like zip lining stuff and creating like getting a chance to maneuver your ship around and stuff yourself. Oh yeah, and I forgot about the that. Bit. That was so cool. It felt so awesome to like twist the ignition shift yourself. Yeah. And the, um, like, the game itself was just designed really well. A lot of people were worried about it not translating over to the Wiimote very well, but... Yeah. I, I felt like it, it made okay. sense, especially considering that it's just a... In the it's real Metroid, cannon, it's yeah. an arm cannon, and then you just hold the Wiimote the That'd way. be like, yeah. It makes sense to me. Anyway. It felt fine. I had fun playing that. I just didn't get very far. Um, I got to, like, some crazy phase on stuff happening, and then I, I didn't really play it through as much as I wanted to. And the second one, same goes. Like, I played it through... To like the water part of that game, and then I got stuck. Man, when you get those super missiles, they just kill yeah. you guys in one shot. It's super satisfying. Yeah, super missiles were the best. But man, five missiles all super at the same missiles time. Missiles are your trump card in like yeah. every fucking me Metro game. Like if there's shit that's giving you issues, super missile in the face, it's gone. More life lessons from Metro. Oh fuck, beam missiles. Do you remember that? Oh yeah, we're just a con just a constant stream. No, depending on which beam you're using, it's a different one. I didn't remember that at all. I just remember the constant stream really? of missiles. Okay, so basically, like you could fucking take your your. And I do remember ice missiles. You could take your power bomb, right, for your regular power beam, and you could fire a missile out of it that's like supercharged. Yeah. But you can get the elemental yeah. variations for it. So you stop doing just <laughs> shit. Good thing I've got. Oh well, it hurt. Well, okay, so. You can take the power blast, yep. and you can fire like a super cool missile, heavy charged, like does a shit ton damage version of a super missile, yep. so it's even better than your super missiles. Or, or like it's the same thing as, or, or something like that. Yeah, this guy's just, you know, through one. And, and then you switch to ice, and then it's even more powerful, Pff, ice is gone. Yeah. And then you take fire, and it's like... A big laser fires out, but it uses your missile so fast, but it just melts through stuff. Oh, that's what but I was thinking But the coolest of. thing... Yeah. For me, my favorite power, like, missile, was you'd go to wave beam, and you charge it to full, and then you'd press the missile button, and fucking this laser beam, just this coiling purple laser beam fired out of your gun until you let go of the trigger, and it just... Oh, that actually beam. might be what I'm thinking. I just remember one long... That was my favorite one. ...like, beam chain thing. Yeah. Um... The, oh, like, shit! The plasma gun did, did some kind of a thing, I don't remember it very well. I'm pretty sure it was just, a, like, a powerful laser that fired out for a while. But I know for sure Wave Beam was the one that shot that that just amazing coil of electricity wow. out of things. It was just so cool. Well, this is where we get double jump, isn't it? Yeah, I'm pretty sure this you, is where you we get war, jump. You do your pipe thing until you get double jump, and then you can do Which it. I felt was kind of a silly sort of like progression to this, especially considering it's well, like. Well, I don't know. You if got you this felt that one. As a kid. I think you just did that as a kid. Yeah. Right now, we're looking back on it, you're like, well, yeah, come on. I don't but know, I like, see why they did it. I think it's, it's just, just to get you to experience the world longer, because we're ripping through this pretty fast. Yeah. Come on! <gasps> okay, there uh, we go. I was like, if you didn't get it on this one, I'll take it to controller for a second. 
<laughs> no. I, I could do pipes. I would, I would fight you over this. <laughs> Seriously? This is mine. Okay. I'm gonna enjoy this until I just... Oh, <laughs> I bleed. <laughs> Alrighty. Oh, God, I love this so much. Here it comes. There's plants. What, what, they what, hurt okay, you. Whatever. Fuck you. Have you scanned the exploding uh, plants? Oh, I haven't. They're like sap oh, nectar weird wait, stuff that's that actually one? explosive from what I remember. Yeah, it's like a, something they eat, I think. Yeah, sap sap, sap chemical, sap, chemical reaction, reaction produces violent explosion when agitated. It's There's irresistible odor of sweet nectar. It was nearly eaten out of existence. Evolution of explosive chemical attacks <laughs> saved it. Now only brave or indigenous creatures die. I think wait, we said ingenious. Wait. wait. Look like there's something on that wall. That might be your chance to examine the. Okay, yeah, I don't know. Yep, it's phase on in the plants then. Now yeah. we know. Fuck. Knowing stuff like ahead of time though is like it feels good. Yeah, playing the tan and then be like, I know why it's blue. <laughs> there it is. <laughs> I wish it made me jump that high. <laughs> Yeah. Can you imagine you press the jump button once and you just go through the fucking ceiling doing a screw attack? Yeah. Oh shit, did they ever successfully implement screw attack in a first person game? I think the third no. person one. I mean, not third person. They only I got think the screw third attack. One might have had it. By the way, yeah, so it's like double jump. Yep. Nice. Perfect. Uh, no, they never implemented screw attack until the third one when you got to go third person. Oh, you go third person for it? Yeah. That makes sense. I think I can get up into that door. Now. Well, save. Right, right, right. Save. <laughs> Woo! Halfway through the episode, my might, might as well. Yep. Save. <laughs> oh, I forgot. That this gives you ammo too. Ammo uh, for what? Like, what do you have? Oh, missiles, right? So Another... the save point refills your missiles? Or... Yeah. No, that that your ship does. Oh, your ship does everything, right? Yeah. But uh, also another cool little Metroid trivia, I guess. Uh, the Chozo built your ship. And gave it to you when you were a kid. That's so nice. Yeah, they gave you everything. Also, when your parents got killed by Ridley, they took uh, you they in, took and, you raised in you, and raised they? you. Yeah. How do I? Oh, here, probably. Oh man, that's so cool. Because they were like, this child is the one. Because like her whole. So that's why, like. Yeah, her whole colony thing or whatever. Every was time you, wiped you out. read about Samus' backstory or like see her talk about it or anything, she's always super fond of the Chozo in like oh, a yeah. parental kind they, of way. Yeah, they raised her. From when she was very, very young. But she totally cared about her family. Oh, so yeah. She was old enough to just, like, get the end of it. Yeah, she was old enough to. Better understand. increase in Fendrana region. That's your first big boy down there. Yeah, it's where you get the wave beam, I'm pretty sure. Chapel of the Elders. You know, the one thing that did bother me with this game, not like in a you bad way. in the room this game. Fuck him. Let's kill the first, kill the first one. Let's kill the second one. Okay. Seriously? Fuck. Okay, there we go. <coughs> there you go. Seeding plant-based ground feeder. Dorsey yeah. spies and ejecting Yep. Can we figure that one out? Yeah, fucking... Sure figure that one out pretty fast. Oh, isn't there a cool way where you can, like, if you arc the beam just right, you can fire it over all of the plant little, like, wigglers and they all go down? Probably. Hit impact crater. This is the... From whole, what? This is the seed. Oh. Which you learn later. But yeah, the, the seed. And I'm pretty sure... Another trivia. <laughs> Uh, the seed. Oh, it's one of those puzzle pieces. Yeah, those are yeah. important. I don't remember what for, but don't you have you to, need find to collect every You need to collect one? all 12 to be able to open the shield, which is containing the in the yeah. center of this. And yeah. A new pirate data entry has been downloaded. Wait, I haven't read those in forever. What does that one say? Alright, we'll go back. Because, okay, so maybe let the chosen Field one be something that are, they pause, but we'll yeah. read these ones. Yeah. Field team reports are in on an aged structure of alien design built on the surface of Talon 4. Studies show this structure projects projects, sorry, Good containment team, field. Team. This field bars access to a prime source of energy within a deep crater. Phase on. Science team believes the field is powered by a number of strange Chozo artifacts. The shield. We have found some of these relics and studies on them have begun. And as this field could hinder future energy production operations on Talon 4, we must dismantle it as soon as possible. If this means the destruction of the Chozo artifacts, it will be done. Yeah, it's like 100% something nobody in the galaxy ever wants to do is yeah. destroy Chozo artifacts because they were so ahead of their time that everybody was yeah. just like, fuck, we need every little bit they can get. Yeah. And it was cool because they were, by nature, a benevolent race. Yeah, which is awesome. Yeah. Unlike on, fucking, oh, fucking like some other ancient races from yeah. pretty much every other sci-fi game where oh, the race oh. is ancient. Oh, foreshadowing. Yeah. You can kind of see now that there's a little bit of orange there. Yeah. 
This is more Trezor lore. We actually have it all. Wait, we were gonna let them. Like, oh yeah, right. If you want to read that, all you can pause it. Yep. So, yep, 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 yep. Okay, cool. Awesome. Yeah, I'm sure some people, um, like by now, most everybody's played or heard of Metro Prime or seen it. Yeah. But oh, yeah, if see, anybody's watching our specific one and they're like interested in that, I, I, I hope that they. And it's up to you for clues on the locations of the remaining artifacts. Open a path to the center of the impact crater. You don't get all of these to the very end, so. Oh wait, remember, look, go back and scan some of the faces. Oh, did none of them come up? What the hell? Or maybe they're on the other side. They're like, you know, to let you know where the remaining artifacts are. That's yeah. what I just said, but it's not giving you any... There's uh, gotta be like one or two guys. Maybe. Oh well, we'll just leave yeah. for now. There's a lot of bird theming in these games. This one specifically. Um, I wonder why. Is that just because the Chozo were kind of bird-like, or what? no? The Chozo were a hundred percent bird-like. I'm not saying they're okay. I take that back. I'm not trying to say <laughs> that they're a hundred percent bird. I'm trying to say that yes, they're very one hundred percent. They were a bird-like race. Yeah. So this is another one. Yep. Press A and then B. It'll just like skip it to the. It doesn't? Nope. Oh, weird. You can obviously see why we wouldn't read these all out. Yeah, they're rather long. Yeah. But if you are interested, do take the time because they are really good. Yeah, the lore is very good. Uh, those ones are written by the Chozo pretty much every single time because they're ancient. Um, yeah, like hieroglyphs and stuff like that. The um, And the reason you can translate them is because you've made them. Your armor's made by them. Yeah. Um, but those puzzle pieces like that are from the pirates, I think, marginally. Not all no, of them, but... Uh, the puzzle pieces are from the Chozo. They're from the Chozo, too? They are. But that they one knew, said they if, knew it you were gonna come. If, it, if it requires the destruction of Chozo artifacts, we will do it. Yeah. So, like, is that the Chozo saying they'll destroy their own no, artifacts? No, 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 it no, sounded no, no, like no, a that pirate's was, That was the pirates thing. saying that they're going to destroy the artifacts of the Chozo. Yeah, so that puzzle piece we just read was a pirate-written dialogue. Yeah. That's what I was saying. Oh, sorry. Like, not all of those, but that one was written by the book. Anyway, we'll, we'll see you guys in the next episode. We're going to just head back to the... I um, can't believe we made that jump. Anyway. Yeah, nice. Yeah, we're going to head We're gonna head over to the drifts, I guess, and we'll see you on the next elevator. Bye, guys. Bye. <laughs>